everyone welcome to our youtube channel and today we are going to see about how to fix a stable diffusion web user interface not working and before getting into the video make sure you have hit the like and subscribe button so that you will not miss the upcoming latest videos so let's get started you need to follow the proper instructions while configuring the stable diffusion ai file else you will end up with the error message in the terminal and you, uh, you cannot launch the stable diffusion web user interface so first you should have the uh, proper system requirement the ui os should be windows 10 or 11 linux or mac and the graphic card should be nvidia graphic card and which will ram should be 4 gb or more than that and the your device ram should be 8 gb or more than that and disk space should be 20 gb to run the stable diffusion without any error if you don't have the uh, compatible graphic card don't worry you can still use cpu but remember that it is not work well with a heavy project you should have a recommended graphic card to avoid memory and loading capacity errors how to fix stable diffusion web ui not working so first go through the error and follow any fixes specified in the error message so first follow the directions in the error message and see if the error is fixed if the direction leads to the another error message then follow the solutions one by one first you need to check the internet connection so usually the error occurs if we don't have the stable internet connection right so check your internet connection and if you find if there is any issue with that fix it by switching to the mobile data or or restarting your router solution number 2 check the python version so the stable diffusion file doesn't work properly without <laughs> have a proper python version you should have the python version of 3.10x uh, uh, so you uh, if you have the uh, 3.9 or 3.11 version of python then you need to uninstall it and install the 3.10 version of python so go to apps and features find click on python and check the version if it is not 3.10 you need to remove the file and install it freshly then after installing the install the python just to restart your system and see whether you can launch the web user interface if you get the error again then open your terminal go to python and install the pip so pip is one of the python module which helps you to run the uh, python programs so you need to follow the instruction here so the curl instruction is to access the uh, website and py, uh, python get pip by is to download the python file and to install the python file you need to follow the python hyphen m pip install hyphen upgrade pip so once it is downloaded then uh, check the open cv python version so you should have 4.7 open cv python version follow the instruction pip install open cv python equal to 4.7.0.68 now close the terminal restart your system and restart the restart your web user interface user file now you can launch the stable diffusion without any issues and you can generate your images if the error persists then follow the solution number 4 that is you need to change the user bat file so open your user bat file and check the line python equal to python where you have to replace the python uh, folder path with the python and then add the command line argument if error occurs because of the charge file then it uh, by adding this command line argument it will skip that error then second is you need to add the requirement file equal to requirements.txt so by adding this line the stable diffusion will automatically <laughs> install the required files and dependencies so if the error occurs due to the uh, missing of module or any file it will be eliminated and you can launch your web user interface file without any error the fifth solution is delete virtual environment directory instead of the stable diffusion deleting the vnv directory will remove any corrupted or incomplete file stored during the previous launch so don't worry the file will be created freshly at a new launch and run web ui user so this may solve the issue if nothing above method works then you need to install stable diffusion from start so uninstall the stable diffusion file then go to uh, official git website and click on code and download the download zip file then again go to the uh, stable diffusion art.com 
and follow the instruction step by step carefully so any of these steps may be let to you make sure you have a good internet connection while installing because it takes 2 to 3 hours to install completely follow the steps here carefully and install it so that is all today i hope you found this video helpful make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for such videos thank you